You mentioned that you have a seven week old who spits up occasionally and you were wondering if there's a cause for concern, what's the reason behind spitting up and if you should think about changing formula. Um, it's a normal occurrence for babies to spit up. This happens, um, this can happen when they burp or when they just uh, have a little bit of drool come out and this is totally normal. Some babies are just spitty and um, it might cause a mess but it's usually not a cause for concern unless your baby is vomiting. That's totally different and will happen after a feeding and um, <clears throat> there's more volume that comes out and one pediatrician said once that if you put the baby on your chest and you're burping them over your shoulder, if the baby simply just has a little bit of drool over your shoulder, that's just considered spit up. But if they, if the, you know, drool or spit up or vomit, whatever you're wondering what it is, goes over the shoulder, it actually is vomit. And if this is happening one or more times a day, this is a cause for concern and a reason to take your baby to the doctor. Just normal spitting up can be caused by your baby overeating. So you could try nursing your baby for a shorter amount of time, burping, um, and then finishing the feeding. And don't underestimate the power of burping because if your baby has a big gas bubble, it's likely to come out and bring stomach contents with it too. So burp your baby between feedings, give your baby some time to decide if he or she is full, and then finish the feeding, and this might help prevent your baby from overeating. Here's a couple of other things you can try to help reduce the chance that your baby spits up. Um, make the environment that you feed your baby in calm and quiet. If there's a lot of distractions, sometimes the baby will get fussy and pull off and it's more likely to get gassy um, and have more burps and more spit up. And also avoid laying your baby down right after a feeding or jostling your baby a lot. If these basic tips and tricks don't help or if you're still concerned, then I would recommend talking to your baby's doctor who can decide if there's, any, if there's a need for any other further investigation or treatment. If you have any other questions for me, feel free to ask them on our Facebook page and recommend us to your friends and family too.